Herself. Scream sheets are saying it was work related stress, but our folks are calling foul play. So, think you can dig something up? Got more deets attached. <laughs> I'm 
on the edge of my fucking seat. Luckily, it's all over. Handled it like a true profesh. I got the data, and you're in the clear. Closing the gig. Thank <laughs> you. 
bar. Uh, this, this isn't a bar? It is, but it's our bar. Get up. Let's take a walk. Hey, leave him alone, cabrones. Hey, back off. Hey, you're busy. My bar. You heard what Pepe said. Take a fucking walk. June, fuck off. Or I implant my blade in your ribs. Just try, Gonk. Come on, let's see what you got. Well, you just got real fucking interesting. Yeah! What, what just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? Because you would have caught a beating. Or worse. This fucking town, these people, just here, minding my own business. If it weren't for you, I'd... Here, for your trouble. The rest, uh, bartender got the rest. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in, Pete. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you, then? On the house. Won't say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Ten years married, you know? Ten years and suddenly I'm not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Pay solid. Run me through it. It's about my wife, Red. Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. Damn sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. Ain't no more than an evening's work. Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'll be on a smoke break. Smokes like a goddamn tire fire. Like half this city. Wait. But today, she was wearing a pink jacket. And, uh, hmm. She had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? Can't say I'm interested. Sorry. Oh, no, 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 wait. Ow. What the hell with it? in the bar? It is. But it's our bar. Get up. Let's take a walk. Hey, leave him alone, cabrones. Si. Hey, Go back off. Hey, you're busy here. You heard what Pepe said. Take a fucking walk. June, fuck off. Or I implant my blade in your ribs. Just try, Gonk. Come on. Let's see what you got. Well, you just got real fucking interesting. I got two words for you. Fuck off. What, what just happened? Landed in a little trouble. Cleaned up now. God damn, sorry. I think I've had a little too much. Fuck, what a night. Why? Why'd you help me? Because you look like you got some eds on you. 
I see. Nothing for free. Not in this goddamn city. Not in this goddamn life. Here, all I got. The rest, bartender got the rest. Circling him like sharks on the scent of fresh corpo blood. Could have ended badly if you hadn't stepped in, Vic. Yeah, well, not all heroes wear capes. How about we drink to you, then? On the house. Won't say no to a free drink. To good fortune and prosperity. Long day? Could say that again. I'm on a double. No break. Working overtime to make an extra buck? Nah, just don't want to go home. Ten years, man, you know? Ten years and suddenly I am not good enough. No, she has to go get some side action. Anyhow, since you brought up money, you wouldn't be looking for a gig, would you be? Base on it. Run me through it. It's about my wife, Red. Name's Cynthia. She's cheating. I'm sure of it. Only question is, who will? Could let it eat away at me. Or I could get someone like you. Ain't no more than an evening's work. Gonna have to keep tabs on your wife. Follow her around town. Where'd she be now? She works nearby. I'll give you the address. Knowing her, she'd be on a smoke break. Smoke's like a goddamn tire fire. Like half this city. Wait. Well, but today, she was wearing a pink jacket. And, uh, she had a blue purse, I think. Colorful. Always like dressing up. Get a woman something nice for her birthday, anniversary. And what do you get in return? You seem confused. Sure she's cheating on you. Let's start with the fact that she always stays late after work. I know she's lying. Called her office one night, she wasn't even there. Besides that, well, we got a kid together, right? Doesn't even look like me. Different hair, different eyes, all of it. Used to be easy to check these things, but with today's tech, there is a way around every test now. Why you want to know who she's with? What's the point? What's the point? What kind of gunk question is that? Simple one. Answer it. I want to look him in the eyes. Ask him how it feels fucking some other guy's wife. Breaking up a happy marriage. Okay, fine. I'm in. You're my hero, V. It means a lot to me. Bar's betrayal of the guiling woman sounds like something out of a pulpy noir thriller. Pepe was used to listening to his customers' complaints, but now it was he who needed to get something off his chest. It was the same old story, an unfaithful wife in a city where everything was uncertain. Are you about done? I'm trying to focus. on the scene, looking for the woman in the pink jacket. The woman with a sordid past. Stop right there.
It was her, the lady in pink, breaker of hearts, framed by a halo of cigarette smoke. I followed her. Dreaming of the day, the narrator put a fucking plug in it. Got too close. Almost scared the dame off. Better be careful. I know, I know. Got too close, again. Something just drew me to her, like one magnet to another. Ugh, stop. The woman looked around. Something weighed on her. Maybe it was my gaze. Keep this up, I'm a fucking puke. Narrate that. The woman passes a bum. Gives him a wide berth. Doesn't want her clothes dirty. Her conscience is already dirty enough. Oh, seriously, what, what did I ever do to you? The dame disappeared into the guts of a building ready to collapse. The air hung heavy with smog and betrayal. Ugh, maybe it's a good thing I'm dying. Hey, careful! You tear my shirt! Well, well, well. you to make sure nobody followed you doesn't matter seen enough but huh what the hell is going on they say lies have short legs but liars oh their gams go all the way up oh what is this scop coming from Job's done. Followed your wife. Went into some rundown pad. Man was waiting for her inside. I knew it. What else? Dunno. Honestly, don't care either. Did my job, now your turn. Waiting on that scratch. You know, I thought I'd be more than just one of your regular clients, but I guess I was wrong. See around me. Silence fell like a wet blanket over the city, muffling its cries. Time to rest, I thought. Time to drink. See? That's more like it. Finally making some sense.
How you know Jackie? That was a good joke. He used to drop by for a round or two. Or then, <laughs> tough guy exterior on the crap after number of press. Big dreams in our head. World's already full of <laughs> oh, V. V, you never learn. I'll give you. Hey, Kirk. Been a while. V? Holy shit! Barely recognize you. I see you haven't changed. Not a single bit. Huh. Well, you know me? I'm old-fashioned like that. Slow and steady wins the race, huh? So come on, sit down. I'll spill you the deets. Start talking. All right, all right. Listen, job's simple. Got a van standing not far from here, brimming with merch worth fat digits. Driving to the border tomorrow, but a lot of things could happen before then. You feel me? Specifics, Kirk. What's in the van? Militech implants. Experimental series. Shit you can't get on the street. Straight out of some lab in Shanghai. And who does it belong to? Jesus, V, who the fuck cares? Once we take it, it's ours. So, can I count on you or not? Sounds too good to be true. Oh, fuck it. It's worth a shot at least.
Chindica permanece fuera de la jurisdicción de la policía de Night City. No ingrese la Pacífica bajo ningún concepto.
Thank you.